Good afternoon, everyone. It's an honor to be standing before you again as the president of the New Jersey Young Insurance Professionals. As I begin my second term, I can assure you that my passion for carrying out our mission has only increased over the past year. As you have heard, we just reached our 25th anniversary, and we're thrilled to be celebrating our milestone with all of you today, especially because there are so many here who have been instrumental in shaping the New Jersey Yips into the organization that it is today. So, as we mark our special occasion, I would like to take a moment to acknowledge all those who have been working so hard to further our mission of building tomorrow's insurance leaders. It is my pleasure to present to you the list of our 21 past presidents, starting with our inaugural, inaugural year 1987 and continuing on to, to the present. Each of these individuals has played a unique role, and we are very grateful to them all. If you're in the room and your name is called, please stand and be recognized. Robin Sadam. Liz Allen, Keith Mitchell, Doug Crow, Doug Bateman, Donald Penn Jr., Tina De Palma Leavers, Mike Avalone, Bob Davies, Mike Estazio, Rob Peasen, Bill Voteris, Kern Thalman, Kristen Jones, Peter Thornton, Charles Caruso, John Calera, Patty Smith, Kristen Scott, and last but not least, Danielle Priore. When I went to college, what seems like a long time ago now, I had a distinct opportunity to become part of the swim team at Stanford University. This was a team that just, had just won three consecutive NC2A championships and had perhaps the strongest tradition of any college swimming in the pro, any college swimming program in the country. And I still remember the first words our coach said to us in our first meeting on my first day on campus my freshman year. He said, you have all just become part of a great tradition and I want you to always remember that you're standing on the shoulders of everyone who has come before you. All of those who helped build this program and everyone who helped make it is what it is today. I would like to thank our past presidents and everyone else who helped to make this YIP organization what it is today. We are truly grateful that we, all of the current YIP members, directors, and officers, have your shoulders to stand on. Yesterday, we held our annual business meeting where we installed our 2012 2013 officers. I'd like to ask the following individuals to please stand and be recognized. Our secretary, Dan Tate from Travelers. Our treasurer, Natalie Bruno from the Diagostino Agency. And our vice president, Casey Yarker from the Robert Petrie Yard Insurance Agency. I was going to ask you to keep standing. So now again. Um, I'd also like to ask the rest of our directors to please stand up as well. prospects alike. If you are or have been a part of our dedicated team of committed 
volunteers and supporters, thank you. We could not have achieved any of our goals without you. If you have not been involved in our organization, I implore you to partner with us, at least in some small way, because even the smallest things can have a big impact. Many of you know that I had the honor of representing the United States in the 2000 Olympic Games in Sydney, Australia, where I won a bronze medal in my event. And I actually have my Olympic medal with me today. What you probably don't know, however, is that I won this bronze medal by this distance, the width of the medal, less than a tenth of a second. And I'm absolutely convinced that it was all of the little things that I did and the little support that I received during my preparation, my training, and my life that simply helped me to make up this little distance, which in reality added up to something really big. So please recognize that even the smallest contributions to the gifts will, without a doubt, add up to something much bigger. If you're an agent, I would ask you to come to our next meeting. If you're an employer of young agents, I would ask you to encourage their involvement. If you're a carrier or vendor, I would ask you to please support us financially because it is critical to our success. And consider any investment in the gifts as an investment in something much bigger. Think of it not as, not as an investment in an association, but as, a, as an investment in the youth and future of our industry. In closing, the New Jersey Yips are looking forward to the year ahead.